Hello, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are good evening, you? Teacher. Yeah. Good. Am I on time or am I on late? Good evening. Nice to see on you. Time. Hello on time. there. Hello, Brenda. How are you? Mr. Lopez, uh, really close, really close on time, really uh, close. Ah, uh, okay, yes. Really close I, on time. <laughs> well, the recorder start at uh, A O one, so we will go out at A O two or A O three. Okay, so <laughs> because I need to check the time very well in, uh, in order not to steal anything for you, especially time. So, are you ready? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yes, already. Good. Do you receive the document? Hi, Elizabeth. What? How are you? What document? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 And some oh, exercises yes, over did. there. Okay, good. So that's for you to practice. And um, okay. And I will ask you to help. I did, teacher. Okay, you you download it. Good, excellent. No, I I, I didn't. Uh, I, I did. But you 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 can you see then on on your WhatsApp? I don't. Maybe I don't. I'm not in your WhatsApp group. Well, it's not my, it's everybody's, but it should be there. Okay, um, check it, check it out, Don Vicente, and okay. let me know if you were able to download. Quizás está en el grupo anterior, Vicente, por eso no ve. Ah, maybe, maybe. In in the group of in the last hey. four, deleted all. Ah, okay. All the members. But if it's not, remind me at the end and I can send okay. it to you uh, uh, through this uh, chat. Maybe it will be possible. Okay. Okay, okay I will. Okay. So um, please, uh, the document, it's important that you work on it. And it's important, guys, uh, that you work on platform also. Please work uh, do your best on the platform and and advance on it. I'm not going to use the term try. No, because we have to, okay? Uh, you have to advance on the platform and do the exercises over there. So remember that tomorrow we're not having classes, so we are having classes on Friday, okay? okay. In order to... On Friday. Um, yes, in order to to have the four classes per, per um, a week, okay, so. Okay. Okay, and let me see, let me know, Casa, okay. Okay, Noe, thank you. Thank you, Elizabeth. Okay, Andrea, thank you. Excellent. Okay. Uh, let me present uh, my presentation over there. I guess it's part two, yes. Okay, on this one, we are going to finish. Uh, let's see if, if we can work this one, this part on 30 minutes and then continue with what is tomorrow's day, okay? So remember that we are talking about in this class, we are talking about landmarks and monuments, and this is the third session. And what day is today? Today it's is first November, November. 1st. Okay, November 1st. And uh, 2023. 2023, of course. Okay, when we talk about some uh, helming over there, uh when uh uh when we talk about uh countries usually we talk about certain topics for example topic number one what is the topic number one that we're talking about a country what is it current currencies and what is currencies and oh, currents 
What is currents? La moneda. Yes, the money that I use in the country. For example, El Salvador, what, what currency do we use? We are using dollar. the dollar uh, and uh -huh. the coin. Ah, okay. The Canadian dollar, the, the Australian dollar, or the US dollar? I guess it's US. The US dollars, yes. So, for example, there are some, when we talk about currencies, we talk about, we talk about the peso, dollar, the pound, okay? So, when we talk about uh, religious groups, I'm not going to ask about this one, we use uh, the Buddhist, we talk about Christians, we talk about Muslims, but this one, yes, this one is important. So industries, when we talk about industries, what do we talk about? Manufacturers. Manufacturers, good. What else? Someone else? Manu. Um. Transportation, I guess. Uh, transportation, yes. Okay. Manufacturing. Uh, okay, so good. So here I have some, uh, we talk about mining. This is mineria, but it sounds min mining. Okay. Mining. Um, yes. And we talk about electronics. El Salvador, according to the, um, what I know, mining we don't have. And that big scale, but electronics we do, okay? And we talk about tourism, okay? Sure. Now we talk about tourism. That's an important industry nowadays in El Salvador, okay? When we talk about cultural products, what do we talk? Cultural products, what do we talk about it? The Ah, ah, we talk about beef, we talk about what? Cereal. Cereal, coffee. cheese, cheese, coffee, um, a week, not in El Salvador week, we talk about cattle, we talk about corn, we talk about, uh, yes, coffee, grains in general. Okay, so that's when we talk about things. So when we talk, when we want to travel to a country, usually we ask for certain information that before we go to that country. And we use about currency, we use some industrial, we use about places and so on. So here we got a conversation, let me just, uh, to take out this one. Here we got a conversation. Uh, let me. No se puede para arriba. Okay. Okay. What is the topic of the conversation? We don't have a topic over there because I cannot see it. Okay. Uh, conversation learning objective. Uh -huh. What is the learning adjective? Countries information. Okay, countries information. And C. The, the passive without by. Without by. Remember that yesterday we were saying uh, the, uh, the English class is taught by Mr. Lopez. Um, uh, what the Statue of Liberty was uh, made, uh, uh, the Statue of Liberty was uh, given by the people of France to the United States and so on, or etc. Right? So let's listen to the conversation. Page 69, exercise 8. Conversation. Listen and practice. Hello. Oh, hello. I need some information. What currency is used in Japan? Where? In Japan. 
I'm not sure. Isn't it the yen? Oh, yes. And do they drive on the left or the right? I think the left, but I'm not sure. Oh. Well, is English spoken much there? I really have no idea. Huh? Well, what about credit cards? Are American Express cards accepted there? How would I know? Well, you're a travel agent, aren't you? What? What? A travel agent? This is Linda's hair salon. Oh, sorry. Wrong number. Uh, where was he calling? <laughs> where was he calling? Linda's salon. <laughs> I was calling to Linda's salon. But, uh, uh, Mr. Giovanni Jose Gonzalez, what was the guy asking for? What was the guy asking for? Uh -huh, Don Vicente? He wants to know uh, something about the, the country. Maybe he he's planning to visit okay. uh, a Japan, Japan country and he okay. wants to know the money. Okay, yeah, thank you. Well, for to drive. <laughs> okay, okay, thank you, Don Vicente. Very good. What else? What else, guys? Someone else? Please talk to me. Yes, Brenda Claribel Mejia. Uh, he is a agent, tra agent, travel agent. Uh huh. Travel agents. And he's calling. Um, I think a person uh, to travel in Japan. Okay, good. Uh-huh. Uh, and what else, what is he asking for? For example, what's currency in use in Japan? Ah, okay. And yeah, what, what do they drive the car? Okay. Left or right? <laughs> okay, good. Thank you, Brenda. Thank you very okay. much. Okay. Okay, what else? What other information, guys? He's asking for uh, wh where do they drive on the left, on the right. He was asking mm -hmm. for money and what else? The English language teacher. Aye. Okay, if they spoke English over there, or what language how many, they speak? Uh, how many people spoke English? Ah, okay. Okay, good, excellent. So he was speaking English. Do you have the conversation available, guys? Yes? Yeah, we have. Okay, I will send you five minutes in a break and room, and you're going to practice the conversation in pairs. So you will play the role of Linda or, or, and John. So... Uh, I call it role play. I don't call it practice because you're going to be, one of you is going to be Linda and the other John. And después, the other is, uh, the one who was John is Linda and Linda becomes Wait, John. Yeah, uh, no, okay. in pairs. I'm going to send you in pairs for five minutes, but please practice, okay? It will be 10 rooms. I will okay. send you in pairs for five minutes. Five minutes. Okay, go ahead. Okay. I will uh, do it manually. Uh, auctions, six minutes. Yeah, it will be okay. Uh, All right. So you should get the invitation in one, uh, three, two, one, zero.
Please accept the invitation and, and role play. Okay, accept the invitation. I have rooms with one people, with one person. Let me send. Okay. Let me resend you. Um, Yes, God, I send you to room six. Uh, uh, Wendy, I move you to room five and Katia Rodas, you were there. Uh, Mr. I... So Hi, Katia. lonely. <laughs> <laughs> yes, that's what I'm coming over here. So let me present the conversation, okay? And we're going to do it together. Okay. Okay. Uh, I am Linda. You are young? Yes. Uh-huh. Okay. Yeah, I mean, okay. Hello. Uh Oh, hello. I need some information. What currency is used in Japan? Where? In Japan. I'm not sure. Isn't it the yen? Oh, yes. And do they dry on the left or on the right? I think the left, but I'm not sure. Oh, well, is English spoken much there? I really have no idea. Hmm. Well, what about credit cards? Are American Express cards accepted there? How will I know? Uh, well, you're a travel agent, aren't you? What? A travel agent? This is Linda's hair salon. Oh, sorry. Wrong number. Okay, let me see how, how much time do we have. Uh, and where did I see the time? Okay. It's counting the time, but I don't remember what it is. Uh, it's, it's, well, it will say when I. Okay. Uh, now you're, uh, you're John and Linda. Okay. Hello. Okay. Oh. Hello, I need some information. What currency is used in Japan? Where? 
in Japan? I'm not sure. Isn't it the end? Oh, yes. And do they drive on the left or the right? I think they the left, but I'm not sure. Oh, well, is English spoken much there? I really have no idea. Uh, well, what about credit cards? Are American Express card accepted there? Uh, well, I know. Well, your travel agent, aren't you? A what? A travel agent? This is Linda's hair salon. Oh, sorry, ground number. Okay, thank you. Okay. Um, we're not, thank let's you. Go, let's go back to okay. the, uh, the rooms, please. Okay, everybody should be coming back right now. This is still running the time. Okay, wait for uh, 60 seconds because it's for everyone coming back. Here we are again. Yeah, were you practice? Did you practice the conversation? Yes, I was practice. Okay, you were practicing, good, excellent. Okay, remember that you can practice this uh, the conversations uh, to the audio that I send you. So the first time I listen the whole conversation and then you listen again and you pause the audio um, live by line and you repeat it. That will help you a lot, okay? And 2019 for everybody to come. It should be closing in a couple of seconds, but every... Some people are coming. Most of we, of us, no, we are here. So we have to wait for them. No, no, just one second. And it, it's, ah, okay. everybody's here. Okay, okay. so um, the conversation introduces, uh, remember introduces uh, by, with, uh, uh, with I mean, it was a passive boy without by. So there you have some examples over there. But let's see how this uh, possible. Okay, the learning objective is says passive without by. And this passive voice is in the simple present. What this means that we, we do not use was or where. We use... We use what? We use, we use verb to be. and the verb. verb to be in the present tense. Good, excellent. We use is or are. Are, are, right? Remember that is is for a singular noun or um, mass noun. And, and, uh, and, R is for uh, plural. Right. Uh -huh. For example, we say Spanish and Nahuatl are spoken in Sonsonate. Okay. Uh, Nahuatl is spoken in Panchimalco. Coffee, yeah. coffee is grown in uh, Santa Ana and Sonsonate and San Salvador. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, the fish industry uh, are is is produced no the fish how do you call it uh fish is raised in lago Cuatepeque. uh something like that. i 
I forgot the 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 uh, the verb from fish. Okay, but that's the idea over there. So let's listen to the to the uh, to this one before I confuse. I get too confused. Let's listen. Okay. Sixty nine. Exercise nine. Grammar focus. Passive without by. Simple present. Active. They use the yen in Japan. Passive. The yen is used in Japan. Active. They speak both Spanish and Portuguese in Latin America. Passive. Both Spanish and Portuguese are spoken in Latin America. Active. They grow a lot of coffee in Brazil. Passive. A lot of coffee is grown in Brazil. So what are we really studying right now is this one. The passive voice, okay? That's what are we studying. Um, again, another example is sugar cane is grown most in most of the country, okay? Uh, coffee is grown in Sonsonate, Santa Ana, and San Salvador. Okay, so that's that's the passive voice. So we are using the passive voice in the simple present. That's why we use the form of B, which is is or are. And let me... So we have, look at the following se sentences carefully. What it says over there? The yen is used in Japan. Aha. Uh -huh. By and the, the Japanese. And the other is? Both Spanish and Portuguese are spoken, spoken in, in Latin America. In Latin America. And that's the example over there. So I made a mistake. Okay. So, uh, but this one, the yen is used in. So we are, it uh, says both are spoken. We use B plus uh, past participle of the verb. Uh -huh. It says, A lot of coffee is grown in, in, Brazil. in Brazil. Okay. So, so we, we are, uh, that's why it's passive voice in the simple present. Okay, uh, let me just uh, go back to the other one in order to get this one and go here and come in again. So those are, uh, any questions about this one, guys? Any questions about this one? Yes, teacher, in the passive, we, we are going to use always the past participle. Yes, we are going to use the past participle with by and without by. So remember, in by is in the simple press, simple past. And, mm -hmm. and, and without by, we use the simple present, passive voice in the simple present. That's why what we use it. We're going to use it. But in both forms, the, the verb, the second verb, or the, or, because uh, was, where, is and are are auxiliary verbs, and the and the principal verb of the sentence is um, is the following: is speak spoken, uh, raise raise, uh, what else? Um, use used, and so on. Grow grown. Grow, so grown. Grown. So we're going to um, we're going to, uh, we are using the the the. The press the past participle of the verb. And in other words, verb three. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank okay. You very much. okay. There you have some sentences over there. I oops. We have some sentences over there. And, and, over there and, and we complete and we this complete one. With this, 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 this. Okay. And uh, for example, it said both French and English. Are used uh, are spoken are spoken, spoken in Canada. Okay. In Canada. 
Are... I'll give you, I'll give you like, like if you had that document over there, like two minutes in order to, and I will ask volunteers. Two, four, six, eight. So you're going to use the verse it, grow, make up, manufacture, speak. We already use it. Teach, teach. use, and wear. Okay, I need seven volunteers to help us complete the sentences. Don't worry if you made a mistake. It is accepted. Okay, don't be center. Number two. Number two. Yes. Okay. Uh, English, English talk, talk in elementary school in Singapore. Okay, let me just, uh, English is taught in elementary school in Singapore. Okay, thank you, Don Vicente. Thank you very much. Well done. Okay. So, someone else, another volunteer, raise it's your hands. Raise, raise your hands. Uh-huh, oh, Edgar, Mauricio. Okay, I'm gonna try. Uh, Number three. Yes. Uh, a great deal of how to pronounce wit. 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 Uh -huh. Of wit in, is manufactured in Russia. Okay, is manufactured in Russia. Uh, Edgar, another option. Is there another option that you would like? Mm. Okay, the verbs are eat, grow, make up, manufacture, and thought. We already use it. Uh, use yeah. and wear. Is there another option, Edgar? Yeah, what is the meaning of wheat? Uh, trigo. Trigo. Uh, mm -hmm. So I'm going to change. Okay, uh, good. Eat, grow. Is grown, is, is grown, grown in Russia. In Russia. Good. You see, you corrected yourself. I didn't have I didn't uh, have to do it. Okay. I didn't me, I uh, didn't know the the meaning I, of wit. Uh, don't worry. Don't worry. But that was a good uh, excellent try. So wick is the uh, grown in the in Russia. Another volunteer? 
both cars and computers. Eugenio, yes, go ahead. Uh, both cars and computers manufactured in South Korea. Okay, both cars and computers manufactured in Korea. Uh -huh. And what will be the verb, uh, uh, Eugenio? What? Remember that we we use is or are. What is the verb over there? Uh, it's are. Oh, R. okay, good. Uh -huh. uh, it's over here because it was not uh, this way. Exactly. Uh -huh. Both computers and uh, both cars and computers are manufactured. Oh, with D. Sorry. Me faltó la D ahí. Okay. So, are manufactured in South Korea. Good. Excellent. Ahí me faltó la D. Ya lo vamos a arreglar. Another volunteer, Mexico. Me, teacher. Uh, who said me? Uh, Juan. Okay, Juan, go ahead. Okay. Mexico is uh, made up of 31 states and a federal district. Okay, so Mexico is made of... Uh, 31 states. Good, excellent. And another a volunteer. Another volunteer. Raise your hand. Kimonos. <clears throat> Kimonos are. Uh, let me see. Where? Some, uh, kimonos, kimonos are kim some, sometimes. Kimonos Kimonos are where sometimes, uh, sometimes in in Japan. In Japan, uh, but uh, near, near Elizabeth, you you uh, use we say you say kimonos are are where or sometimes. Uh huh. In can, Japan, can you separate the verbs? Use one verb. Uh, kimono. Another verb. No, verb? separate the verbs because you use it together. Oh, okay. Uh huh. Uh, kimonos used. No, I. No, kimonos uh, were, were sometimes. Times in Japan. Uh, but I don't, okay. don't, don't understand. Okay. Okay, okay kimonos. Mm -hmm. This uh, is the uh, words uh, that I mean. Ni, ni uh, yeah, kimonos. Uh, okay. Uh -huh. okay. Are sometimes wear in Japan. Good, okay. excellent, okay. excellent. Worn <laughs> in you. Japan, excellent. You correct okay. yourself. Oh, good, yeah. excellent. Okay, okay. Another, thank you very much. Well done. Another okay. volunteer. Okay, Claudia Maria, go ahead. It's the currency that is used in Thailand. Okay. The genesis currency that is used in Thailand. Don Luis Alfredo, you want you want is uh, the last one. The last one. Uh -huh. A lot of beef. Uh, is uh, a lot of beef are eaten. In our ah, country. a lot of beef is eaten. Uh, yes. Uh, uh -huh. yeah. Uh -huh. It this is because it's a mass noun. You cannot, uh, puede contar las piezas, pero no toda la masa. Uh -huh. no uh -huh. It's not plural. It's, uh, ah, okay. The mm -hmm. thing is that it's, it's called a mass noun, nombre de masa. Uh -huh. That's why okay. we use uh, a lot of beef is used, is eaten in Argentina. Delicious, what I thought. Everybody, an applause. Good, excellent. Congratulations. You're doing. You're going, you're doing on the, on the wrong place. Okay, let's, uh, let me see. Whoop. Let's, let's do this one. Whoops, sorry. No, we're here. Yes. Okay, uh, let's go on the listening over there. Just take notes, uh, have your um, a notebook or a notebook uh, ready in order to take notes. 
we're going to hear uh, some facts about Colombia. What is Colom where is Colombia location? Where is Colombia located? Yes, Nia Elizabeth? Excuse me? This is America? Where, where is Colombia located? This is America. And this is America. South America. South America. So we're going to talk about location, a population, language, religious, industrial, and agricultural products. Okay? So just take notes. Page 70, exercise 11. Listening. Listen to a short talk about Colombia. Complete the chart. Colombia is located in the northwestern part of South America and is the fourth largest country in South America. It has coastlines on both the Atlantic and the Pacific Oceans. It has a population of around 36 million and is a very beautiful country with snow-capped mountains as well as hot lowland plains. The capital city is Bogota, which was founded by the Spaniards in 1538. Almost all Colombians speak Spanish, which is the country's official language. The religion of the majority of the population is Roman Catholic. Some of the most important industries are textiles and clothing. Other industries include mining and oil. Agriculture is the most important section of the economy, and Colombia's main agricultural products are coffee, flowers, sugar, bananas, rice, corn, and cotton. Colombia produces more coffee than any other country except Brazil. Okay, one more time for you to take notes. Only write notes, okay? Page 70. Read one more time. Mm -hmm. 11. Listening. Listen to a short talk about Colombia. Complete the chart. Colombia is located in the northwestern part of South America and is the fourth largest country in South America. It has coastlines on both the Atlantic and the Pacific Oceans. It has a population of around 36 million and is a very beautiful country with snow-capped mountains as well as hot lowland plains. The capital city is Bogota, which was founded by the Spaniards in 1538. Almost all Colombians speak Spanish, which is the country's official language. The religion of the majority of the population is Roman Catholic. Some of the most important industries are textiles and clothing. Other industries include mining and oil. Agriculture is the most important section of the economy, and Colombia's main agricultural products are coffee, flowers, sugar, bananas, rice, corn, and cotton. Colombia produces more coffee than any other country except Brazil. Okay, uh, where is it located? It's located in South America. Northwest South, South America. America. Yeah, Northwest of South America. Northwest. Good, excellent. Northwest of South America with the coast. Pacific Ocean, Pacific Atlantic. Atlantic Ocean. and Pacific Ocean. Uh, population? Three, three, million. Six, six million. million. There is around 36 Visit. million, approximately. You can say around, you can say approximately, wow. approximately, okay. or you about. can say about. Yes, excellent. Okay, you can say about. And uh, language? Spanish. 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 Uh, there is the official language. Religion? Catholic. Roman Catholic. Roman Catholic. Roman Catholic. Roman Catholic majority. Okay, but there are mm -hmm. other uh, groups uh, growing up. Industrious. Mining and oil. Textile. Man, textile, clothing, mining, mining and oil. And oil. Those kind of things, okay? Mining, right, textiles. And agricultural products. Coffee, rice, bananas, bananas, corn, and cotton. Corn, corn, corn. Corn. Okay, and it said that Colombia is the country which produces uh, more coffee than any other country except Except Brazil. Except Brazil. 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 The Samba country. <laughs> okay. 
the Samba country. Okay, so we have finished the first topic and we're doing great because we have still like like, like 20 minutes. No, uh, 17 minutes. Okay, it's been a, it's been a, it's been a, Long, a time. long time. It's been a long it's time. It's been a long time that I haven't seen you. Uh, let me take out those. I don't know how to take it up, investigate in order. Um, okay. It's been a long time. When this, uh, the topics are, what are the topics? It's been a long time. And what is the top? What are the topics? Information about someone's past. Information about Okay, event. and past events. So this is our three section, and today we already know. Okay, success stories. Do you know who is, don't read, don't read. Do you know who is uh, Oprah Winfrey? Yeah. What do you know about her? He has a, a show... Uh, a TV show, okay. A TV television show program, okay. A TV it's program. A, it's a reading the book. Oh, okay, good. Okay, and do you know who is William? Uh, William. Uh, what's his name? Uh, William Harry William Gates. Gates. Uh huh. Uh, William Harry Gates. Yes. Yeah, we know. Uh -huh. Who is it? Don't read. Is the uh -huh. the made uh, apple it's the most yeah. important million yeah. people? Okay. The first, the first computer, personal computer, the first. Oh, okay, the personal <laughs> computer. So yes, uh, we Great. have uh, these people over there. Uh, Oprah Winfrey and uh, Oprah Winfrey and uh, and uh, uh, Bill Gates. Um, Bill Gates um, third, yes. So they both the, have a okay. very successful life, okay? Personal information, the offer, uh, Brenda Claribel, what is uh, personal information about uh, Ofra Winfo? With me? Yes, uh-huh. Okay. Personal uh, information. With... Okay, Oprah Winfrey reaches entertaining in the USA mm -hmm. were almost uh, around 2,000 million. Yeah, 2,000 million, okay. Personal, so born January 29, and... Miss uh, and 19, 19, uh, 1944, uh, 60, 50, 60, okay, 54, <laughs> sorry, in Mississippi, <laughs> in Mississippi, okay, thank you very much, Maria Jose, and what is uh, about education? Okay, education, B, A, in speech and per performing mm -hmm. uh, from State University. University. Accomplishment. At, at Nin 19, was first African American news and an anchor? Uh -huh. an anchor? Anchor. 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 W T V F and TV in Nashville. Okay. Thank you and very much, Maria Jose. Thank you very much. So, and let's say, uh, uh, Juan Antonio, what about Bill Gates? Ah, oh, Bill Gates. Let me see. The richest business. Man. William Henry Gates. Uh huh. Okay. Uh, riches. Uh, this may be sorry. Uh, businessman, businessman in the world. In the world, okay. World almost uh, 20 okay. billion. 20 million dollars, okay. Okay, personal Person information. Uh -huh. Yeah, personal information about him. 
uh, born October 28, 1955, in Seattle. In Seattle. 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 Washington. Seattle. Washington. Seattle. 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 Washington. Washington. Okay, thank you, Don Antonio. Thank you very much. And, uh, uh, and uh, let's see, Wendy, Lisette Carillas. Uh, uh, education. Education dropped off of Harvard University after second years. Okay, accomplishment. Grow the first computer language for personal computers. Uh huh. And I And I think founded Microsoft Corporation, the world leading computer software company. At 31, become the world's youngest billionaire. Billionaire. Okay. Uh -huh. At 31 became. Okay. I was hunting iguanas. Meanwhile, Bill Gable <laughs> was making a lot of money. <laughs> okay. Okay. Thank you very much. So we know that there are uh, some people that they have successful. Okay. For example, the word accomplishment. What is accomplishment? This one. Maybe relation with business. Okay, maybe relate with business. Another idea, someone else? Achievement. Achievement, that's a good definition. That's a, a very good definition, achievement. For example, you, one of your accomplishments is to speak English. Okay, uh, that's accomplishment for you. Uh, one of my biggest accomplishments is be become an English teacher. And a good one, by the way, I know it's, <laughs> it's not true, uh, is becoming an English teacher. That's why well, my accomplishment. So let's see, uh, let's see on this conversation. Okay, uh, Wendy Lee said, where are the people? Where are- In, in the restaurant or a cafeteria? Okay, in a restaurant or in a cafe, good. And what else, uh, Catherine Vasquez, what else? Another extra information that you would like to add? Yeah, they are having dinner. They are have. They might be having dinner, they are having dinner. Uh, Don Vicente, do you want to say something? <laughs> <laughs> they are in a meeting. Okay, they are in a meeting. Let's see what about these people. So, um, well, let's listen to the conversation and let's try to answer these questions, okay? If you have the conversation, it's, it's okay, you can. Page 72, exercise two, conversation. Part A, listen and practice. How did you get into modeling, Stacy? Well, when I graduated from drama school, I moved to Los Angeles to look for work as an actress. I was going to auditions every day, but I never got any parts. And I was running out of money. So what did you do? I got a job as a waitress in a seafood restaurant. While I was working there, a customer offered me some work as a model. Within a few weeks, I was modeling full time. Wow, what a lucky break. Okay, take note to answer the Page question. 72, exercise two, conversation, part A, listen and practice. How did you get into modeling, Stacy? Well, when I graduated from drama school, I moved to Los Angeles to look for work as an actress. I was going to auditions every day, but I never got any parts. And I was running out of money. So what did you do? I got a job as a waitress in a seafood restaurant. While I was working there, a customer offered me some work as a model. Within a few weeks, I was modeling full time. Wow, what a lucky break. Okay, uh, when did Stacy move to Los Angeles? When she graduated. When she graduated from drama school, yes. What did she want to be? What did she want to be? World. 
Oh, customer. Okay, she wants to be an actress. She wanted to be an actress. Where did she get a job? Customer offers her the job. Ah, she got a job in a restaurant. In a restaurant, <laughs> yes. What is she doing now? Modeling. Oh, she, she's modeling. She's working as a model. Okay, so that's uh, it, 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 was it easy for her or was it difficult? Well, was difficult. Was difficult. It was difficult, but uh, she had a lucky break. Okay, we're going to see later on what. So on this conversation, we are studying. We are contrasting what? Between past and past continuous. continuous. Past continuous and simple. And simple past, okay? So past past. I was working in a restaurant when a customer offered me a job, okay? I was meddling, uh, I was studying at drama school when I moved to Los Angeles, okay? So that's the idea. But let's see over here. We still have like uh, four minutes. Page 72, exercise two, conversation. Part A, listen and practice. How did you get into modeling, Stacy? Well, when I graduated from drama school, I moved to Los Angeles to look for work as an actress. I was going to auditions every day, but I never got any parts. And I was running out of money. So, what did you do? I got a job as a waitress in a seafood restaurant. While I was working there, a customer offered me some work as a model. Within a few weeks, I was modeling full time. Wow, what a lucky break. Okay, that's, uh, we see some examples. Uh, let me stop the presentation. Okay, remember that, uh, let me look for your attendant list. Uh, remember that tomorrow no classes, but we have tomorrow, okay. we, we have classes on Friday. On Friday. Yes, we okay. have classes on Friday, okay? So in order to uh, finish the week. And also, uh, please work on platform, okay? Es important that que trabajemos los ejercicios de la plataforma para poder ir avanzando. Recuerden que el personal, I'm sorry my Spanglish, el personal de apoyo nos eh, eh, va poniendo sus uh, actualizaciones para enviadas a Insapor el día viernes, okay? Teacher. ¿Sí? Excuse me, eh, en la primera clase la perdí y yo supuse que podía entrar a la plataforma con el módulo 3, pero solo me sale el módulo 2. No sé qué es lo que estoy haciendo mal. Ah, no, entonces en ese caso tendría que escribir, pon en el chat, lo, el personal está atento ahí, que pues que no le sale el, el módulo. Entonces, no ajá, para que ellos se lo activen. Okay. okay, perfecto. Estoy en intermedio, ¿ok? Mi módulo, mi intermedio. Sí, sí, sí. Pero... Uh -huh. Sí, sí, intenté dos veces, pero eh, pensé que era momentáneamente, pero ya probé y no, no, no me sale. No le sale. No, pero voy a, voy a escribir. Okay. Ajá. ok, por favor, sí, para que sí. Alba Maricela Interiano no es de aquí, ¿verdad? No. No, Emi sí que está cargando esta cosa. Ah, Rubén. Ah, ya lo encontré. Ellos están pendientes de las personas que escriben que no les sale. Ok, me dice present Ana Sonia Elizabeth Martínez. Presente, teacher. Eh, Andrea Esther Acosta Hernández. And Andrea Estera Costa, Brenda Claribel Mejía Segovia. I'm here. Present. Eh, Cecilio Antonio Cortés Escobar. Present, Mister. Claudia María Gómez Canizales. 
Presente. Edgar Mauricio Barrera Ortega. Presente. Eh, Eugenio Ernesto Martínez Fuentes. Present, Mr. Giovanni Josué González Olmedo. Present, teacher. Eh, Jennifer Nauset Arevalo Flores. Present, teacher. Eh, Juan Antonio Brand de Paz. Present, teacher. Catherine Mar eh, Mariel Vázquez Flores. Present. Laura Concepción Mena Caray. Laura Concepción. Lorena Araceli Hernández de García. Lorena Araceli. Lorena de Los Ángeles Mengíbar de Najarro. Eh, Luis Alfredo Aguilar Bertrán. Present teacher. María, María José Najarro Mengíbar. Present teacher. Noé Ezequiel Rivera Medrano. Noé. Norma Lisbeth Crespín Orellana. Oscar Alexander Domínguez Herrera. I'm here, teacher. Saraí Noemí Trejo Suyoa. Vicente Israel Sánchez Erazo. Present, teacher. Y Wendy Lisette Carías de Cedillos. Are you there, Wendy? Present teacher. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, guys, sleep time. Try to rest tomorrow and see you on Friday. See you on Friday. 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 Thank you. Okay, teacher, thank, thank you. you. Have a nice day.